Billy, I'm the folk out top L I'm a Tui Vi. They call me Coach V. Billy, I'm a Tui Vi here, Coach V, with your Tuesday motivation. Our topic for today is an oldie but goodie, a basic fundamental inner approach to our outward circumstances. Gratitude. To be thankful. To be grateful. For all and take nothing and no one for granted. The one thing about gratitude it is that I would like to speak on today. It's not just the joy, peace, happiness, and fulfillment. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Gratitude. No. I'm talking about the gratitude that comes with such focus and honed in energy that most people might think you're mad because you have positioned yourself and you have worked so hard to be in an opportunity that you have been praying for, that you have been hoping for, that you have been working day and night and diligently going through the emotions of relationships, emotions of the struggle to now position yourself where now you must be grateful for the opportunity that you care less about everything that's going on, where the enemy's greatest weapon, I really believe that this is the enemy's greatest weapon and also our greatest weapon against ourselves is allowing ourselves to be distracted by all the stuff that we should not be looking at and we should not care about. I don't care about what's going on with this person in their relationship. I'm so grateful for what I got that's so good. I'm just going to focus on my wife and my family and what we got going on and all the goodness that we have positioned ourselves with that we now must do this that shows great attitude of gratitude and that you are grateful for the opportunity is that you can actually take an idea or an opportunity and now execute finish, perform, and win. And if you don't win, that you can learn the lessons that are invaluable to a testimony that will come in the future because people think that we just learn the lesson first and then we take the tests in life later. No, that is academics. That is the classroom. In life, leadership, business, sports, and in relationships. See, in marriage, in raising kids, and being an entrepreneur, you take the test first and then the test teaches you the lesson but yet we should still stand grateful grateful for amazing grace unmerited undeserving grace favor wow that is your Tuesday motivation May it bless you. May it guide you. May it do what it is that I do with my clients. May it stir your heart, mind, and soul so that you don't listen and do because I tell you, but you listen and it stirs your heart, mind, and soul so that you can figure out what you need to do by listening and being fully aware of all the goodness and the spirit it is that is whispering to you. Be grateful. Go do it. Dream big. You can be. You can achieve anything and everything it is that you have ever dreamed. Not because I say so, but because life and he says so. And that's standing grateful. Live it. Billy, I'm the folk out top. I'm a two-year-old. They call me Coach Reed.